Well, I'm back to another episode here of Outer Banks, episode 3 a season 2, and this one is called Prayers. We have John B, and we have the big Sarah, but Sarah's obviously been shot. He basically um, calls Terence and directs him towards um, the big doctor guy. They managed to get there, but a doc then, but the doctor essentially, um, he's not even a doctor, by the way. Um, basically, John B pays him with, like, the gold. But during all this, like, there was, like, tourists there. And they, like, took a picture, which then led Rafe and, uh, Ward seeing that at the, um, police station. It was funny, like, Ward was admitting, like, he doesn't give a shit that he shot Sarah. <laughs> but it's, like, obviously, Ward's a bit fucked up. Well, they're both fucked up. But, yeah, the other plot point in this episode is, like, we've got Key, JJ, and, uh, Pope. And essentially, they get like a letter for like a scholarship that sa that basically says, "But John B, that guy, he's innocent, and they've got evidence that will prove it." But yeah, um, and they want a meeting with Pope later that night in Charleston, North Carolina. So why? Who knows what's going to happen there, guys? Well, who knows? Who knows? But yeah, basically, we get um, the most important part of the episode: Sarah's operation. Obviously, here, John B has to pay the doctor guy with the gold. But I actually thought she was dead here, like she flatlines, but it seems like we're just a, like a low pulse, you know, or one of those gimmicks. But yeah, and then John B obviously breaks down, but then Sarah's alive, which is um, all good in the hood. Meanwhile, um, Kay basically had an argument with her mum and dad about heading to Charleston. They're like, they want her to go to boarding school, motherfucker. But I, board then basically on to um, trying to track down Sarah. And uh, thingy, but essentially, what happens there is that um, the, the doctor guy gives those two the corn, and they basically escape. Um, and then they reach a boat with Cleo, but then a police officer arrives. Cleo basically sacrifices herself, allowing John B and Sarah to start the journey up north. Meanwhile, they're, as they're heading up north, we basically see Pope Key and um, JJ. Heading north as well, and they're basically arriving in Charleston at the same time. They're going over a bridge while they're going underneath it, which I thought was a really cool um, parallel. But I, I feel like this episode was definitely a bit weaker than the other ones. But I guess like the parts where you thought Sarah was going to die was good, but the rest of it, yeah, it was a bit weak to be um to be perfectly honest, guys. But anyway, in terms of a rating out of ten, I'll give this one a five. I feel like it's probably the weakest episode of the show, to be honest, or at least up there. But anyway, till next time, leave your thoughts down below and peace.